Hi, I'm Craig Holton and this is my week 7 video diary. Saturday for me was a, a bit of a stress because I was ill in the daytime and I wasn't even allowed to rehearse or we allowed to do the dress rehearsal. Um, so it was when I went on stage in the night time, it was the first time I'd ever been on stage with the band and first time I'd rehearsed with them. So I took the time out before the show to do a real, real warm up of my voice. And then because I wasn't allowed to do the rehearsals, <clears throat> I had a good few hours sleep to rest my vocal cords. And then I just prepared really well and went out there. And luckily, it was probably my best performance. I'm so excited that Amelia's returned because me and Amelia are really good friends. Um, so for me, I was delighted and she, she should be worthy of being in this competition anyway because her talent and her vocal ability is, she has to be in this competition. Um, without a doubt, she is probably one of the best, or if not the best um, female vocalist we have on the competition. So I was quite proud to be able to see her come back. Meeting Lady Gaga was... Uh, an experience for sure. It was she was so lovely and she was so what I didn't expect her to be like. She was really down to earth. And when Kitty had just left, she said, "Don't worry because I was dropped by four record labels before I even got my first album out." She said, "And it's the same feeling as what you're you're feeling now." She said, "And don't be affected by it when you do leave the competition. Be embraced by it and be pushed forward a little bit more." And to have someone, probably the biggest pop star in the world right now, say that, that's a little peace of mind. And she was truly a lovely person as well, and she gave everyone a little gift each, so. I'm now going to answer some Twitter and Facebook questions. Hi, Katie, thanks for your question. Um, would I be ever interested in doing a musical? You know, definitely in a few years' time, I'd, I'd, I'd love to look into other avenues of what else I could do, um, but right now I don't think I'd, I'd like to do a musical, but in a few years, I don't know what could happen. Hi Sam, thanks for your question. Um, yes, I do write my own music. I, um, I've been writing lyrics since I was about the age of 10, and I have so many books full of lyrics, and my computer is full of it, and around my bedroom, if there's a slight piece of paper and I hear someone say something, or I think of something, I write it down really quickly. I was 16 when I wrote my first actual song, although for the few years that I started when I was 10 I was just writing little lyrics and never used anything, but when I was 16 I wrote my first actual song which had a middle and then the intro that, that everything into it um, and it was about uh, a little love stupid thing that happened and it was about how fairy tales don't come true. Aww. Hey everyone, thank you very much for watching my week 7 and hopefully I'll be here next week and doing my week 8. So thank you very much for watching.